people from where I was sitting, they were long too. Uh, you know, here's the, here's the deal. There, I mean, um, I think we got a pretty good basketball team. <laughs> and uh, you know, start of the game, you know, you prepare and you watch film and you get your guys ready for, you know, their speed and their toughness and their aggressiveness and how hard they cut and how hard they play. And, uh, you know, even with your male scrimmage, scrimmage guys. You, you can't mimic the pace and, 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 and the way that they play. Um, you know, I tell you, Gab with Gabby and uh, Fisa and, and, and Katie Lou, you got three All-Americans, Masters team, you know. Uh, when I'm in that room at the, at the Final Four being the chair, uh, and now, you know, there's a minimum, there was a minimum number before on how many can be on that, on that on that uh, team of 10, uh, it, it's going to be really difficult to keep Stevens and Nurse. They're going to be in the argument. <laughs> uh, um, but I thought, you know, we talked to our, I talked to our kids midline, multiple efforts, charges, loose balls. Uh, it's a, it's a, it's a 35, 40 point game and they came up with all the extra effort plays, you know, and again, uh, and they don't. They it didn't matter what the scoreboard for them was, and for us, uh, for us to be successful, I thought the ball didn't go in the basket for us, and we didn't defend and go to the go to the glass as we usually do, and and for us to have an opportunity, I think we're a very good offensive team, but for us to have a chance, we can't uh, we can't shoot as poorly as we did, I think. Uh, I think uh, you know our three perimeter guys went four for forty. You know that's tough. That's tough to. The game started like I said, it was five for six. They're five for six. We're one for six. And we bang a timeout. It's eleven to two to start, and you're an up, uphill climb from them. The bright spot for us was, you know, I thought, uh, you know, our bench: Vanessa Blackman, Alyssa Raider, Shea Leverett. Those guys got some some really really good minutes, uh, experience wise. Um, but it's one game. This can't affect Temple. You know, we got to put this behind us. We got to go on the road, get Temple, and then get ready for UCF at home, and then go on the road to Wichita State and Memphis. You know, uh, we'll see him again up there, and we plan on seeing seeing him again for the conference championship. It um, it looked like Kit, who was being guarded by an All-American, got a little more frustrated than normal, taking out of her game for a lead. Did you notice the same thing? Yeah, I mean, I'm sure everybody, the, how many fans did we have here? Everybody else noticed that she was frustrated as well. Coach, you talk about getting ready for Temple. Is it harder to walk away from a loss like this or like the five-pointer at Oklahoma? Uh, you know, I, I think, you know, I think we got, we went up to, you know, the, the five-point loss at Oklahoma. We got into some foul trouble and some different things. We went up there. I think we're ranked 15th in the country, and you know Oklahoma. Oklahoma played a lot harder than we did. You know, and they came down to that fourth quarter. We led all the way throughout, and they made baskets, and uh, they took four or five charges, and they competed. You know, uh, bottom line, we got our ass kicked today, and you got to put it behind you, and you got to get ready for the next game. Well, I mean, she wasn't really guarded against Southern. She made open shots. You know, she's had to now, you know, against Tulane, it's a little different. You're getting guarded. Uh, same as Cincinnati and, and, and today. You know, they switched one through five, and Kia's one of the better defenders, better defenders in the country. But, again, I think they did a good job on her, but then uh, when we reversed the ball, we also got – open shots from other guys that didn't make shots either now. You know, if they take Kit away, we got to have other guys step up and make plays, and we didn't get that. So it's just not about Loxa having a bad game, you know.